the vision for Iraq and its people issued by the US, the UK, Spain and Portugal at the Azores summit on March the 16th, 2003, included a solemn obligation to help the Iraq people build a new Iraq at peace with itself and its neighbors. The declaration looked forward to a united Iraq in which its people would enjoy security, freedom, prosperity, and equality, with a government that would uphold human rights and the rule of law as cornerstones of democracy. We have considered the post-conflict period in Iraq in great detail, including efforts to reconstruct the country and to rebuild the security services. And in this short statement, I can only address a few key points. After the invasion, the UK and the US became joint occupying powers. For the year that followed, Iraq was governed by the Coalition Provisional Authority. The UK was fully implicated in the authority's decisions, but struggled to have a decisive effect on its policies. The government's preparations failed to take account of the magnitude of the task of stabilizing, administering, and reconstructing Iraq, and of the responsibilities which were likely to fall to the UK.